What is up guys? Tommy here. And today's the day. As you can see, as you see, as I'm dressed in packs, I am on holiday. I'm in London. But right now I'm in London. Just passing through really. Just uh, gonna get a train down south to Portsmouth where my parents are and my granddad as well. <laughs> just a day out and then right today is just the travelling there and then gonna stay the night in Portsmouth and then next morning do a bit of sightseeing on both Portsmouth and the Isle of Wight. And then the next following day, which will be the Wednesday, Wednesday I'll be, sorry, on that very same day, I'll be travelling to Brighton and then take a few sight shots here before coming back towards Hull this way. Right, I need to be, I need to hurry up a bit because apparently my train was delayed by nearly an hour due to the, due to the local complex of passionate times and hours. You, you name it, just a lot of reason why it was delayed. Oop. And I'm in a bit of a pickle. Hopefully, I have less than 20 minutes to get to my train. So hopefully, I'll get to it. Oh. Sometimes they don't think of alternatives. But oh well. If I miss this one, I'll just wait for the next one. Lovely. I'm in the northern line. I'm an expert when it comes to the underground. For someone who doesn't, who doesn't live in London, of course. I just take one simple line and <laughs> yeah, just uh, trying to find the northern line. <laughs> right. To think, I was only here. I was only here two days ago with Richard. <laughs> it's like it wasn't that long ago. It's like I never left. Right. I need to get to Waterloo. I'm not going to catch the train after all. I was in a hurry. I went on to the, I, I had to change from the Victoria line to the Northern, Northern line and there's a funny thing, I took the wrong one. <laughs> I took the one going northbound one and I did the southbound one. <laughs> by the time I saw, you know, by the time I realised I was too late to get off so. Now, there's no way I'm making it to Waterloo in less than four minutes. Oh well, just have to take the next one. Right, just made it into Port, just made it into London, Waterloo. And luckily there's a train, I've just missed the half pass, but it's up here. Yeah, there's a train to foot. There's a train at quarter to five. Right, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna get a beverage. I'm bloody thirsty as hell. Got some train, got myself a few things. A little more pricey, but I'm in a hurry, so what? I think the quiet zone will suit me. Wow, when you see some parts of the UK, it just looks so sad. So yeah, a bit of a funny story. I apparently missed my stop. <laughs> I missed my stop, you see, which is just further down this way. Started to get off at South. Started to get off at South Sea. I was supposed to get at Frampton. I was supposed to get off at Frampton where my hotel was. But instead, I got off at South Sea because <laughs> funny thing was the train. The train was twelve cars, and I was in the back four. I just tried to rush to the front. I tried to rush to the front of the train, but I was too late, and the doors just shut. Oh well, 
I'm here, got a bit of time. Just gonna go to the hotel, put my bag down, then go to my parents. And uh, I think I'll call it a day, and then tomorrow, get going. Good morning guys, I just went to the McDonald's, got myself my breakfast, <laughs> and a raspberry ripple, love the stuff, I always love the drink, <laughs> I mean all summer right, I've waited two years to have this drink, anyway, uh, right, so what I'm doing today is, I'm meeting up with my dad, in, so I meet up with my dad at the station, and what we're going to do is, we're going to go to the Isle of Wight again, yes, I know, I've been there before, but, something interesting is happening, you know, something new this time. See, on the Isle of Wight, they've got some new trains, you see, and they're up doing upgrades onto the line itself. So that's why we're going to have a look and see them see them for ourselves. Plus have a day out, father and son-wise. Then afterwards, I'll go see my granddad, and then, later tonight, I'll, I'll be making a train. I'll be on my way to Brighton. Sorry, it'll be my trip. Sorry, I'll be on my way to Brighton. And, uh... That's where I was staying. Been there before, but don't want to talk about it. <laughs> right, just need to go to the station and collect, you know, just need to go to the station and get ready. <laughs> Having breakfast as well. Believe it or not, I did it again. I got on the wrong train again. <laughs> the thing was, there were like two, there were like two types of trains here. One goes all the way to Portsmouth Harbour, and the other one just stops as far as Portsmouth South Sea, which is more in the centre of Portsmouth. The one I wanted was for Harbour, but I, I took the one that was stopping at South Seas, and ah, uh, I should have known. But then again, I'm not local, I'm not familiar. I mean, one time I had to get a bus to Portsmouth Harbour, because there wasn't that much of a hurry, and... <laughs> All sorts. Well, just gonna find my dad and uh, off to the Isle of Wight. Be an old tram where this. I know my trains want to get the moment because they're doing the upgrades as we speak. The only place in the whole world that has a hovercraft service. Well, they have. They have brought the. They have brought the tram. So, just made it onto the Isle of Wight. Of course, I've just seen no trains running at the moment. That's where the uh, hovercrafts depart, as we already know. You probably see that they've raised the platforms a bit because the trains are slightly a bit tall, are, are slightly taller than the old ones. And that's what we're going to do next. We're going to go. We're going to go to Rye St John's and see if we can see the new new locomotions. Sorry, units. It's a nice sunny day. So many people came on the other way. I mean, the ferry was packed and everything. <laughs> but luckily, I managed to get on. Right. Here we go. So, what do you reckon? Yeah. So, what are you saying? That's there as a backup? Or? No, that's just sitting there. Alright. Out of the way. Yeah. All the new trains are sitting in there. Aren't they? Yeah. Unfortunately, the new trains are sitting in the depot and. There's still that old one that's still yet to go to the scrap. <laughs> what a bummer, really. Just walking back now, all disappointed. So, well, let this ruin my day. Right, 
right, just uh, been all over the island. Uh, well, the north part of the island. We've just done all we did. A bit disappointing about the trains not being able to. So we won't be able to see the trains, unfortunately. But you know, there could be another time. And, uh, <clears throat> but yeah, we're just going to wait for our ferry back onto the mainland. And you know, carry on there. I will do a bit of what that and before I take my train to Brighton tonight. Look at that. What a view of the ocean. Just on the ferry right now. And over there is our destination. Portsmouth. Services to the to the Isle of Wight, cheapest as well. <laughs> the seagulls, a beautiful view, isn't it? There's our destination, the mainland and Portsmouth. This? A yacht owned by a billion, a Russian billionaire, eh? <laughs> Ah, yeah, that. Like a lifeboat. So it could be a lifeboat as well. You know, there are some with a... So, yes, I am currently in Gosport. I just went across the ferry. The uh, reason here, because this is where, you know, this is actually the actual place where my dad grew up, was born and raised. And, uh, you know, I'm going to go see my granddad, who I haven't seen in almost, you know, two years since the lockdown, so... Pretty good. Uh, bus is here. I mean, looking around here, it looks, it looks so dead. It's tormenting nearly. Right, I'm just going to carry on for a bit and then. So I'm going to meet my granddad, catch up a bit, and then I'll be heading off. I think my dad used to hang out here a lot until he was my age. That's my dad and my granddad. I'm currently on the uh, Gosport ferry. That's Gosport behind me. In front of me is Portsmouth, where my train to um, some of my train to Brighton will be. I'm gonna get probably get a magazine maybe just for. The, just So I'm just on the uh, train to Brighton, um, almost there. I'm gonna, you know, you know, that's it for the video, that's it for the J. Um, obviously, I would have aired the Brighton video, I would have aired the Brighton video like first, just to, you know, just, just a bit of a twist. But anyway, thank you all for watching. It has been a good, it has been a good adventure today, and I'll see. Hopefully, Brighton was as great as well. Thank you, and I'll see you around. Oh, be sure to subscribe, like, comment below for any suggestions, and I'll get back to you once I'm recovered. Thank you so much. Thank you for joining me, and I'll see you around. Goodbye.